Please welcome to the stage, Mr. Thomas War. That's Patrick Keelty, ladies and gentlemen. The sexiest man on radio, is he not? Yes, he is. Not a lot of people know that Jules Holland is his father. Did you know that? Got him the gig, didn't he? Darling, I've got a gig for you. What is it, Dad? Well, it's a bit of a funny one, really. It's uh, two in the afternoon, uh, playing only to retired and self-employed people. Uh, Sounds a bit iffy, Dad. Well, no, it's all legit. It's Radio 2, but you can't swear either. You can't say ruddy. Wow. Doesn't sound like my kind of thing, but I can't afford to be choosy at this moment. I'll take it. Hey, darling, I, I do love you, you know. I said I love you, darling. Look, I love you too. I've got to go cats ovulating. <laughs> Patrick Keelty. Yeah. How nice. There's a man here still holding his own elbow. You really are resilient, aren't you? Do you come here to reflect on other things? I go to comedy gigs to think about things. I find it very relaxing, the laughter and the ambiance. It helps me relax. I'm going to think about my childhood. I hope you're not thinking about that now, are you? During my set. This is show business. I've earned this. There's a green light over there. Showbiz. You, uh, live in a nice house by yourself, or...? There was a little eyebrow movement, ladies and gentlemen. Animation has occurred. But you've never been applauded for raising your eyebrow before, huh? You got carpets in your house or wooden, wooden floors? Okay. Well, it's a good time to get new carpets. Because the Allied sale is now on. And just listen to these fantastic carpet prices. Pure wool carpets now only $9.99 a square yard. And you could save loads and loads on three-piece suites, many at half price. So get down to Allied this week where seeing is believing. <laughs> All right. Human contact feels good, does it not? <laughs> Lovely stuff. Lovely bonding with you. These are my mum's glasses. She wore them when I was a boy. <laughs> Darling, no! That's a brief summary of my childhood. <laughs> Spared you the details. Yeah. You've got to keep your eyes open, haven't you, these days? That's what I like about boiling water, have you noticed? Boiling water's always got its eyes open, hasn't it? You see that? Boiling water's always paying attention, even in full flow. Because even if you add more boiling water from the kettle into the boiling water in the pan, the boiling water in the pan still goes, huh? Oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Likes to know what's happening. <laughs> then the frozen peas come in and the boiling water goes, oh, no. I've got to start again now. And it takes the enthusiasm of the younger boiling water to inspire the older boiling water to start again. Come on, Dad. We can do it. See, look. Oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> There's no ending to this joke. I just stop. Sorry if you needed closure. There wasn't any there. Maybe go to a closing down sale or somewhere else. You on board yet? You're touching both elbows now. You've closed up even more. I've uh, been thinking about Kelly, who was my ex-girlfriend recently. Thanks. No, I'm over it. It's fine. But Kelly, uh, I met Kelly in Weatherspoons in Kingston. You been there before? Yeah, yeah, it's all right. No, Kelly was there. And she sounded like a duck swallowing a piece of bread when she said her own name. Hi, what's your name? Colo. And she, uh, she didn't have many opinions, so I had to pretend that I didn't either to impress her. <laughs> I'd say, what do you think about that, Kelly? She'd say, I don't know. 
I'd say, me neither. Then she'd smile. <laughs> a beautiful smile, loads of gaps. More gaps than teeth. I remember the day she told me it was over, which sounded a bit like this. What's over? <laughs> As I heard those words, it was like everything was going in slow motion. Like the moment you realise you just stood on a snail. But you've heard the crunch already, so you know there's nothing you can do. You hope it's a minstrel. <laughs> Deep down, you know it isn't. Green light's on, gotta go. I'll leave you with this. Because it belongs to the BBC.